Okay, welcome back. Well, for this video, it's more of like an uh, update on the official stable release of Android 10 for our ROG phone. Well, as you know, or some of you may not have known, but they already released the stable uh, Android 10 on their website. And as you can see, as it turns out, uh, Beta 9 which was the latest before, turns out to be the official Android 10. You can see that in the... Sorry, you can see that on your version over here. As you can see the software version here, it says uh, 2001.60. If you check on the ASUS website, it's the same 2001.60. So for those of you on Android Beta 9, that's the official version already of Android 10 for our ROG phone. And some of you were asking how come Play Store on Beta 9 is not yet certified. So all you have to do if you're at Beta 9 is click on the Play Store and clear your storage. Right after you clear your storage, just go back, open Play Store again, and from here, as you can see, down here, uh, give it some time, and you will see that Play Store is now certified. So, you don't have to upgrade anymore through the website or to the official Android 10 as long as you are at beta 9 trust me that's the official version already of Android 10 see down here Play Store device is certified and also it also passes safety net already see so in case you download safety net Already, all you have to do is the same thing. Just long press. Open your storage, clear storage. And click it again. See, as you can see, everything's working. Safety net passed. Play Store is now certified. Device is certified. So, what you could do next now is just download the ASUS updater app this one I'll be putting the link again on my description if you haven't seen the link on my other videos or haven't downloaded it yet then as soon as you download this app uh, be sure to grant its permissions also to make sure it checks for update and you don't have to do it manually you can always uh, grant here through battery optimization Go to settings, battery optimization, and click don't optimize. So this will be running on the background uh, continuously for checking updates. Just bear in mind that this will also consume very minimal battery. So just a thought. If you don't want that to happen, you can always just open the app, check for updates. And as soon as you get an update there, just click on download. It will be downloaded on your uh, file manager. Then just transfer it. Just transfer it to your internal storage and update as usual. So I hope I was able I was able to help you guys on the clarification. So again, if you are on beta 9, you are on the official Android 10 version already. You don't have to upgrade anymore. You don't have to worry about it anymore. So it turns out We've been using the official Android, for those people who's been on Beta 9, we've been using the official Android version already for a f about a week now before before the website has, has published it. So there, as you can see again, it says 2001.60 and as you can see on the build number, 2001 on my software information down here it's 2001.60 so I hope I was able to clarify these things for you and if ever you have questions 
don't forget to hit the hit the message button and send it. I'm trying to answer as much as as fast as I can because I'm getting almost a hundred messages a, a day, and I hope you understand that I uh, me too. I I have a, a job. I have a day job. So don't worry if I don't answer right away. I'll do my best to answer you. So if if ever you have questions, don't forget to hit me. Uh, please like and subscribe my channel. Hit the notification bell so ev anytime. I have new videos to get notified. So thank you so much for subscribing and God bless to all of you. Alright, till next time.